all right everyone how's everyone doing today i hope you're ha you're all right you're having a good day so um i've checked the transfer news and it seems like Denis suarez is going to come to us now on loan and i was thinking of the best possible formation to play him in arsenal's team now um my guess is that emery is bringing suarez to replace ozil and probably looking for options for him to leave the club because of his wage um the size of his wage and also because he doesn't seem to well i don't think emery believes he fits his system of play but in the assumption that ozil stays this is the possible lineup i see for the club and um i'll try to test this formation against man city because at least let's see the pressure against the best team in the league at the moment and so We'll see how it goes. I'll switch formations during the match and I'll bring in some other people or probably just one other person and then we'll see how um, they're able to cope. But I think Suarez would be a good signing. I think with this formation, they would have a really good um, con uh, control of the midfield. Well, it's hard to say if they're able to, you know, gain control of the midfield with Manchester City but still these four guys at midfield are good in passing the ball and so they would be able to at least keep the ball among themselves and also set up Lacazette and Aubameyang to uh, run and score or assist as the case may be so let's see how it goes I'm absolutely delighted to be here I decided not to do it with you because of course, the current um, couple of players that now has, that's including injury. I don't think they will be able to cope with City's attacks on the wing. More competitive the league, hasn't it? Just there's another kid on the block, and uh, it is so competitive. You've got to run your club and your team very efficiently indeed. In the match. This is the Arsenal lineup. Bent Leno starts in goal. Sad Kolasinac starts. With Carl Jenkinson as the fullbacks, Granit Xhaka starts. I with believe Jenkinson can get a chance anyway because Aubameyang I haven't really seen him put a foot on all the time this season. Yes, they're again smaller team, but still he looks a bit sharper. And um, Leach Turner's age is beginning to show on him. Fernandinho in the middle of the park. Sergio Aguero is the sole striker. Xhaka. Denis Suarez. So Arsenal coming out here in a pretty tough fixture, but they'll still be fancying their chances. Lacazette, Aubameyang, great save by a diving goalkeeper. Oh, it's got to be. Well, the flag's up. He's frustrated because he is caught offside. Maybe he made his run a bit too soon. Yeah, he's having a little go at his teammate. He did want that pass earlier. Denis Suarez. Aubameyang. This is how they love to play on the break. Well, he's got the ball there in the defensive zone by to put them in front. Oh, Into the oh. here. What a big goal that might turn out to be. <laughs> I mean, we don't know if to push and press and be as strong as that, but if this happens in the match, that would be fantastic. A goal from Ozil, and he couldn't have took that in the bottom left any more accurately and hit with real power. Arsenal in front there. David De Bruyne. Nicholas Otamendi. Sergio Aguero anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Mesut Ozil. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. Aubameyang. Denis Suarez. It was good progress with this attack. 
Ich kann viel. Uh, So, in the assumption that Ozil leaves the team, then I'll substitute him with Iwobi and then change the formation to a 4 3 3 defensive system and so I'll put the and Flick Suarez just in front of Shaka and Zarera because he's the person <coughs> who's able to dribble, create space and make long passes and so he can allow um he can create distractions with the midfield and I'll allow Obama Young, Iwobi and Lacazette to run in from behind. Start of the second half so with Arsenal well, hopefully in front. I get pressured in the next um in this next second half. I'd like to see how Manchester City would attack. Denis Suarez. Now here's a chance to get at the opposition. And I'd like to see how this formation holds up with them. Lacazette. Granani Chaka. It is a team that can really hurt you with the number of passes that they play. Change of direction. Infield. What about this for a shot? Optimistic. Praise for trying the shot, Alan. Well, his teammates aren't too happy. Kevin De Bruyne. Silva. Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Manchester City have the ball again. It's good work between these two. Granani Chaka. Lacazette. Carl Jenkinson. Here come Arsenal in exciting style. Need 
brilliantly intercepted. Silva giving the opposition a problem with their interpassing. Manchester City are on the attack now. This is how Sterling! Uh, uh. One on one, and he stood up to the opposition and kept it out. Well, you can't ask for a better opportunity than that. Should have done much better, should have scored. Now Suarez. Just a period of keeping the ball for the team that are winning the match. Sane. Done well to hang on to the ball. Now he needs a pass. And it will be their throw. Well, City is going to press me a bit more. The manager's going and to I think that gives you the absence of a man now Suarez. in the centre Woking. attacking midfield to pressure their defenders. And so Any their Suarez. midfielders are beginning to come forward. Granny Chaka. It's lovely to watch the ball being passed. So this sort of there's level more of freedom on the wing. It's the understanding, the technique, the movement, the weight. But the centre has with a fist. And that is now not game. held up as much as it did in the first half. Activity line. on the bench for the losing team. A substitute getting ready to come on. But Emery likes wing play, yeah, so I guess this would suit him. He'll just encourage the players to press more. Something he's been doing since the first the beginning of the season. Carrying the ball forward, it's the Manchester City. This could be it. No! Oh, that's great well, work I by hope the goalkeeper. He takes like that against us now. Aubameyang. There's a dangerous feel to this attack. It's looking with great vision here. Oh. That was pressure for the goalkeeper from that through ball. Well, you could see Suarez running in now, and he's able to arrive right from the midfield while Chaka and Torreira are able to maintain Aguero. possession. It's Aguero. Nicely lined up for the set piece specialist here with this free kick. <laughs> Well, he has gone for goal, but you wouldn't really know it. Look at it again, well, well away from the target. No, he won't want to see that one back later tonight. The We've got two added minutes. That's be been signaled now. Two minutes of added time. Good vision. In with a chance. And there's the cutback. Oh, charge down. Promising build-up. And... It's over, so, and the referee blows the whistle for the last is, time. This uh, is what Just I think about the, the match. Actually, I played. Oh yeah, that's one there. It's been a near perfect day for him and his team. Yeah, I played this before, and um, Suarez actually the, scored the goal. Two goals into the that's before I played so this one, which I'm including. So I think Suarez is actually a very good addition to the team. He's very fluid in his play. He runs forward and backward dribbles, something that Arsenal has not really had too much of in him in the wild. So I think he's going to be a good addition and um, let me know what you think about this formation and if you have something better. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.